As the city of Boise waits for a federal judge to rule on the legality of its anti-camping ordinance, a homeless camp near the Interface Sanctuary is causing increasing concern. Scott Logan has the story. A spokesman for Mayor Dave Beter says the emerging homeless tent city behind the Interfaith Sanctuary is a public health and safety challenge that is quickly growing. It's my understanding that the, the Postal Service does not feel safe delivering mail there anymore. The Boise Weekly reports mail for the nonprofit sanctuary is being diverted to a post office box as more and more tents and shanties arrive on an island of land off Americana Boulevard owned by the Ada County Highway District. And it's not, the city says, because there's a lack of space at the sanctuary. You can just see for yourself that what has people concerned is, well, the squalor that's out here right now. And other people are also concerned about alcohol and drug abuse happening here. We asked one of the Tent City residents. We hear all sorts of stories about drugs and alcohol out here. Is that true? To a point. There is some people out here that do do it, but I don't. And there's quite a few others that don't. He told us many homeless people prefer to camp here rather than stay at the shelter because they don't like the sanctuary's rules and curfew. City Hall says it's working with stakeholders to deal with the situation that has gotten out of hand. Scott Logan, KBOI 2 News, Boise. Now we did try to contact the director of the Interface Sanctuary, but so far our phone calls and emails have not been returned.